Bell, and thanks for um, organizing this course. Uh, why don't the panelists come on up for this first session? Um, and I'll introduce them as we go. A uh, couple of announcements I'd make for this morning session. It's listed in the program as an hour and a half. This, these are actually each going to be two hour sessions. So we'll go till noon. Lunch is from uh, noon to one. For the candidate members, new members, and allied health members, there's a luncheon at noon that I hope all of you will attend. This is um, going to be in the uh, Lapidus Watson room, so it's, it's moved. Originally, it was scheduled to be outside. It's going to be on the penthouse level um, of the hotel. Um, so I wonder where Dr. Hemming is. We're missing. Um, Dr. Hemming, and hopefully he'll show up in just a second, but we'll uh, go ahead and, and start. Uh, Yvonne Pedreso is going to, uh, as Bill mentioned, will provide imaging, and um, if clarification is needed from our panelists, we can go back and look at uh, specific imaging studies. Uh, Eduardo Santibanez is uh, well known to this group. He heads uh, uh, transplant program and HPV programs at Hospital Italiano and uh, Buenos Aires. To his left, Peter Matrakis heads a transplant program uh, at McGill in Montreal. Um, Mike D'Angelica is a uh, surgeon from um, Memorial Sloan Kettering, also well known to this group. Jacques Balgetti has traveled uh, here from Paris. Jacques heads the transplant program at Hospital Beaujean in Paris. And uh, is leading the uh, organization efforts for the IHPBA meeting, which will be in July uh, in Paris. And hopefully, uh, all of you have considered traveling to that meeting. It's going to be a great meeting. Well, what I'd like to do, first of all, before we uh, begin, I have one disclosure. Uh, I 